listen if somebody is in a position that i want to be in and they are giving good advice i'm gonna take i'm gonna today y'all we gonna package up a big order It's your girl Zania Shy, aka Miss Shy Girl and Kerself, and I am back with another video. Seriously, I'm like, every time I film, they're kicking my damn tripod. So, as you guys can tell from the title of the video, I am back with a mental health up mental health update. Um, from my last video, from my last video, where I basically was like about to lose it. Not really about to lose it, but definitely was about to cry. Um. I was crying. That's why I kept looking up. I was crying. Um, so basically, it's been about a week and a half since that video. Stop. And I am feeling Bye. a lot better, but not much better. Um, I am uh, taking a break. Not really taking, sorry, not really taking a break from Shiger Inc. Um, I am doing more offline orders and stuff and wholesale right now um the site is down at the moment because well for one honest, in all honesty i ain't paid so the site is down because i ain't paid and then once i do pay it i'm gonna lock it um and probably relaunch the site for january um and then anybody who wants to purchase the christmas sets which i did finish the christmas sets can purchase them um June, through July. paypal invoice but oh, mentally i am a lot better sorry guys i was getting a call i'm filming on my phone right now my camera is December. charging um mentally i am feeling a little bit better um i'm not quitting my business at all that thought has kind of just went out the window so i've had a few people hit me up on instagram um it's looking for wholesale right now the biggest wholesale item that we have is our beard products um so we've been wholesaling the oil the beard bombs the cleansers and now the bonnets um so you can get the beard bonnet wholesale through us you just kind of let us know in the yeah you kind of let us know in the in your inbox and yes and then um you know just email us your logo and things like that um so yeah so we are still going strong i'm just taking a break from the site for a, mo a moment plus again y'all know it's very transparent here i didn't pay for the site you know honestly I've, i had the i have the money to pay for the site but i'm just it's not a priority it's a priority but it's kind of not a priority because i kind of want to redo some things um so yeah as far as like my life goes my life is still sh <laughs> clearly y'all can hear it in the background my life is still crap um i am getting a new job a new nine to five y'all know i've still been working nine to fives um i'm getting a new nine to five but it's not really new it's kind of like one of my older ones i'm going back to a job that i previously left um i did start working in a salon today so yeah there's that um, um my hair did grow some more i kind of don't want to come up too much because but my hair did grow some more um i want to do a lymph check in a few months to see because i know as far as like my back goes i am guys i'm past my bra strap all right but my hair is not all even honestly my cut goes like that i hate i fucking hate the v cut in the hair i hate it so much i hate it so much but yeah so there's that um so my job that i'm going back to look at me rambling i know i'm good for this the job that i'm going back to is overnight so um, I will be working overnight, so I'll have maybe a little more time in the daytime. Um, but if I do this in the salon, not really. I'll probably have like a few hours in between the two because one is over, it's from 12 a.m. to 8 a.m. And then the other one is from like 9.30 to 5, except for Thursdays and Fridays, it's like 11 to 7. So we shall see. But I also don't know what days I'm going to be working at um, my group home job. I am waiting for my drug test and stuff to come back, which I should be good. Your girl is clean girls clean um but i did see a couple posts and like some videos and motivational videos and stuff where they were saying like you know there's a lot of people who be just ready to quit their nine to five and you know um or quit their business when things are not going right and my thing is my nine to five will fund my business until my business can fund my life 
and that is just that that is just that that is just that like i've been really consistent with filming i have a lot of videos that i'm editing i'm in the process of editing at the moment um most likely when this video goes up there'll be two videos up prior to it um i'm not gonna post every day i did want to do this thing where i tried to at least post a video every day just to build consistency but i also don't want that to be like a thing and then when my channel does start to pop like people are expecting a video every day um but i probably can do that for a for like if we're being realistic here i can do that because i do vlog a lot like right away my camera's up all the time i just don't post a lot of the footage because i feel like i don't know if it's youtube worthy sorry i i have an anxiety thing but i don't know if it's youtube worthy so like i won't post it but i'm actually about to stop doing that and start posting them um so if you guys see my chains i don't know if i gonna ask but this aquarius chain is from me i just didn't get any more to like sell i was testing out the quality and stuff of it i love it and then this 1993 chain is for me this is available on my well, on my website once I do open my site back, um, I have from 1990 until 2000. I'm working on like the later years. Um, they don't have anything. The vendor that I had doesn't have anything earlier. I am trying to find another vendor who has like the 80s and stuff. Um, so yeah, but I, I'm also thinking of getting these chains like this, kind of like the nameplate form for the chains for the zodiac chains i don't know because i did see some other ones i don't know yeah. but yeah so um i'm going to continue to work my nine to five because one i have kids to take care of and shagger inc is not in a position yet to fund our life any money we make for our business completely goes back into my business so we are not in a position right now to just quit a nine to five you know um so yeah I was watching I it was a Gucci Barbie video yesterday, one of her Vlogmas videos. I'm late with everybody's Vlogmas videos that I be watching. Sometimes I come in here and even watch TV. Um, I literally scroll on TikTok all day, all day. <laughs> I'm actually gonna make TikToks when I finish this, but yeah, all day. So, um, she was saying something in a video where you know a lot of people quit when things get hard and they're just like you know crying about it, how this is not what they wanted it to be, or you know they're not in a position where they thought they would be when they started this so she basically was just saying like she's had her days where she realizes that like what she went through made her who she is today watch out baby made her who she is today and kind of helped to build and structure who she is today and that it's okay to cry it's okay to feel like none of this is going right it's okay to feel like you know uh i don't want to do it but you still got to get up and get it done and that, that stuck with me. Again, I said it before in, previous, in, in my previous video about me wanting to quit. That I hate when people be like, oh, because such and such and such is younger than me. I'm not going to take advice from them. Listen, if somebody is in a position that I want to be in and they are giving good advice, I'm going to take I'm gonna take that advice no matter how old they are. I don't care if they're older than me, younger than me, or the same age as me. But she's literally in the position that I want to be in when it comes to her business, when it comes to her YouTube, when it comes to her social media following. Like she is where i aspire to be not saying that i literally like want to be like her or be her no because it's never been like that but she is in a position where i would like to be and i would like to be in the position to say that you know i'm a full-time youtuber i'm a full-time influencer i'm a full-time business owner like that's the things that i would love to be able to say and a lot of her videos lately she's been very transparent like um, you know, she's been showing herself and her struggle and how her struggle has made her who she is. And I like that because a lot of times these YouTubers get really big and they kind of just like forget that they were in the same position that a lot of us are in now or that they really came from nothing. Like she literally will tell you she built her business from the ground up solo. Well, not really solo. She had her mom to help her. But, you know, like promoting and all of that is all her. So I just... I, I took a lot from that video and then I think I watched a couple other videos where they were saying similar things like I don't remember the names because it wasn't people I watched vividly like avidly um but they were saying things like you can't give up especially to us mom mompreneurs I hate that word I can never say it right like at the end of the day we're doing this for our kids we want to give our kids something that they can be proud of when they get older or something that they can step into when they get older if that's the route that they choose to go. Like right now, Koi is asking to make body care products. So 
my next couple weeks may be just that well no because he's going away for christmas but you know new year's may be just that i may be teaching and grooming my son to make his own body care products to drop his own body care line like maybe that's what it is because i noticed i give uh oh i give really good advice and really good tips to a lot of my friends to like help with their businesses or youtube and things like that and they have been blown up and then it's just little old me <laughs> little old me like i know what to, it's like i know what to do but what i'm thinking of to do is not working for me what i what i know to do maybe works for other people but it's not working for me so i'm still in the process of trying to find what works for me to get me where i want to be as far as my business and as far as my youtube go yes emory uh -huh. you made a you, okay i'll pick it up when i'm finished okay it's okay you're gonna try oh ask quit to help say help please say thank you, thank you. <laughs> he dropped the chair um so yeah like i'm i'm just gonna reevaluate a lot of things but i'm gonna try to stay consistent so far this week i think i've posted two videos if this is the same week that this video goes up i don't know i may not post this video this week i might i think i might because what we got wednesday thursday yeah so this might be friday's video um and you guys might get a vlog saturday sa saturday or sunday but i'm trying to have my schedule to where i post maybe a sit down chat video on wednesday um maybe some type of actual content of me doing something like makeup or hair on friday and then like a nice little vlog on sunday that's the goal we'll see i'm gonna try to stick to that because i do pick my camera up a lot so it's just a matter of like pre-filming like before when i was like when i first started i i learned to pre-film and i would pre-film and edit a lot of things but i didn't know that i could like pre-schedule but now that i know like i can schedule my videos that has helped a lot too because now I can get this video, like I'm filming this video. I was able to edit two videos last night and get them scheduled in the days. Um, I'm still going through the footage and stuff on my phone because y'all know I did start vlogging on my camera, which this is the camera I have. I have a Canon um, SX740HS, I believe. I was gonna get the the G7X, I think that's it, yeah. I was in Best Buy to get that and they literally didn't have any more. Like before I went there after work, they said they had a lot. And then when I went there after work, they said they didn't have any more. And then this was there next to it. It was like $400 cheaper than the G7X. And it literally does the same freaking thing. Only thing is they said for like vlogging wise, this would be a much better vlog camera. And y'all know my issue before with the first camera that I had was this bad boy i didn't have a viewfinder my little sony did not have a viewfinder but i now have a viewfinder so this camera has been working pretty well um aside from like the issues with my computer but i think it's because my computer is also old y'all i was buying a macbook just in the excited to be buying a mac computer i didn't care and i didn't realize that i bought it 2013 and i'm having a lot of issues with um like trying to upload and things so i was reading somewhere that i may have to take my cam my computer and trade it in so i may have to do that when y'all see this wall again it's gonna be a lot different <laughs> this wall is definitely gonna be a lot different like all of this is gonna be down um except for the calendar i mean the the map it's just gonna probably be a 2022 map um but all of these sale things are gonna be down i do have to finish out though our sales for the month yeah i have to finish out our sales for i mean for the year so basically this paper here is like our sales for 2021 from january to december and as of right now we made the most money in august and that was because i did do a brand ambassador search which i may do at the top of january um because I, I do plan to have the site back up i do plan to have the site back up um january so definitely gonna do that and do a brand ambassador search here on youtube as i mean not youtube on tiktok so make sure y'all follow me on tiktok at zinnia shy um so you can participate in that one um it is going to be free products i think the way i did it last time is the products was free um there was a code the product was free and you guys just paid a little five dollar shipping so and the people that were serious about it really did it but a lot of them only posted like maybe once once or twice and then we're given a code like it was special instructions and the people who follow the special instructions were given a code but only like one or two of them still post to this day um we also do have a paid ambassador program on our um website where you sign up to become a shy doll 
you get a code you give yourself a code and you basically get 50 percent off of each sale every time your code is used um so far out of the ambassadors we have seven signed up i believe and two of them their codes have been used which is this paper here in the corner the two whose codes have been used um and or used the most so that's definitely something that i'm going to start promoting more um just to kind of generate traffic and get more ambassadors um so yeah so we're gonna do that but i just kind of wanted to come and check in on you guys i feel like i rambled off and went off into other places but let's just bring it back a little bit more mentally i am okay um physically my body is very tired i'm in a lot of pain um i've been in a lot of pain for a while emotionally it's just ink emotionally it's just in and a part of that a lot of that my cousin thinks is because i'm not in a relationship but i'm taking a pause on that right now because i had to do a backtrack and i posted on facebook today like it baffles me how i've dated air quotes dated men and they've watched me struggle as a single mother not with one but now with two children like y'all literally just watched me struggle and then y'all had the audacity or as my, my girl on, on, on TikTok said, the um dap city, to ask, be asking me for money and asking me to help y'all. Like, y'all didn't know I was sitting here struggling trying to take care of me and my kids and my household. Like, I've literally, me and my child has lived, the Koi has lived on our own since he was two years old. Like, what? <laughs> what? I got, I want to do a video on that too. Like, being a single mom and bumping my head and doing it twice. Like, my experience, like, my story time of how I became a single mom twice over. Like, crazy but you know i love my kids regardless and i just had to like take a break from that and i was like i'm taking a break from relationships plus i really want to completely love me like growing up i loved myself i didn't care what nobody said i didn't care what no guy had to say what no guy thought about me than that now i let a lot of that affect me my mental and i'm just like no so we're gonna stop doing that we are definitely going to stop doing that 2022 is all about full self-love you sleepy you sleepy okay come on <laughs> okay come on lay down okay 2022 is all about full self-love and me just being me like and okay with me and setting my boundaries with friends and family and guys mainly guys and family because i have a lot of family that oversteps their boundaries with a lot of stuff in my life that is none of their business and that too like i'm going to stop expressing certain things and venting certain things of my business to certain family members and just uh, certain friends and just people in general and learning to like <laughs> keep things to myself um so yeah i am doing a lot better i'm taking it day by day that's all i really can do is take it day by day um i'm getting a lot closer to god like i grew up in in a church going household so i'm just not understanding like i strayed afar a lot for a long time um i'm grown now so it's not like can't blame it on my mom um so i'm definitely working on you know rebuilding stronger a stronger relationship with god and just keeping him as close to me as possible through everything i've been think don't touch I, 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 I. see now you gotta get down i've been thanking him through everything the good the bad the crazy the unknown the confusion like i've literally just I think he's sick of me at this point. Like, we, we talk every day. <laughs> we talk every day, all day. No matter what's going on, we have to have a conversation. Um, so, yeah. I like this. I like doing this side because I like my blue. I love my blue. Oh, back here, it's like... Emery, get out. Because you keep touching stuff. Stop touching stuff. I gotta cut all this out and keep touching um so yeah i'm okay i'm okay i'm getting better i'm taking it day by day i'm gonna just keep going and keep focusing and just doing what i gotta do to make sure i get where i gotta get and to go where i gotta go you feel excited <laughs> so yeah don't forget to like comment subscribe give this video a thumbs up hit that post notification bell <laughs> button and subscribe to the channel and hit that ding dong hit that ding dong you heard my baby so yeah i'll see you guys in my next video yep and peace hey guys